Hi, you guys. Welcome to another vlog. Okay, so this morning, Hubby told me that he's getting tickets, last-minute tickets for a Rams game today, which means I'm going to watch a football game. I don't think I've ever been to one, and um, I'm not, you know, a sports head. I'm not into sports and stuff, but, you know, something to do. Hubby wants me to go, so let's do it, right? So I'm like, okay, I want to be comfortable, casually comfortable, and, but I still want to look cute, right? <laughs> so I'm sitting here trying to figure out what I want to throw on, because I kind of want to have that, you know, just effortless, you know, casually cute type feel or whatever, but still be comfortable. So let me show you guys, um what I think I'm going to wear to the game today because I only have like an hour and a half to get ready. Okay, so what I'm thinking is I'm just going to wear these jeans. There's some casual jeans with a little bit of, you know, fading. Um, And they have a little cuff there. So they're, you know, kind of like high rise with a little cuff. Haven't decided yet, though, if I want to, because I'm definitely going to do a crossbody. If I want to go with this simple crossbody from Coach or if I want to kind of look a little bit cute put together with this crossbody from Coach because this one is cute. Either one will work. But what I'm doing is I'm doing a sweatshirt vibe. So I'm going to wear my burgundy like San Diego West Coast sweatshirt, which I think is cute. And then, you know, I'm just going to wear a tank top underneath it. It's California cold, you know. And with me going through changes, honey, I need to be able to cool down. <laughs> So, and I think these Nikes will go well with this little ensemble. So, that's what I am planning on tossing on today for the game. Hopefully, it's fun. And then for shades, of course, you guys know I got to be out there loped up. I'm kind of leaning towards these because I like the color of them. And I think they will actually help to kind of make the outfit a little bit cuter than it typically or than it actually is these are cool too but i think i'm gonna go with those so anyways let me go ahead hop in the shower get dressed do a little something with my face and then we'll be heading out so yeah i'll check in with y'all later Christmas memories. Okay, you guys, so this is the final outfit for my football game today. I went with my sweatshirt. Like I said, I was going to a little tank top underneath. I got on some distressed jeans, a little distressing on the knees, and the bottom is a little distressed too. And then I have on my Steve Madden sneaks in the burgundy color. And I also Hey, so since you're doing it, I'm going to do it myself. Check it out, y'all. I got my, my hood classic long tee, you know, because we finna go to Inglewood, go to this game, right? You got to have your hood classic 26 inch, you know, gold. This is my everyday. I do have something I can step up, but this, this is just a football game. Here, I decided to go with just some regular old blue jeans and just some regular, you know, Nikes. Really? <laughs> anyway, so like I was saying, my Steve Mann kicks. And I have my coach purse here to kind of dress it up a little bit, even though I'm casually cute today. So, Let's go. yeah, that's, you know what? And these are the looks. So, I gotta buy me some football gear when we're down there. Really? Let's go. All right, we out. We're riding in the Porsche today, y'all. Get to go to the game in style. <laughs> my little, little girl over there chilling. But, yeah. Is this the stadium? Is it inside or outside? Uh, it's, uh, What's that? it's enclosed. Oh, it's enclosed? Mm -hmm. Okay. I have to put y'all on pause while I put on my seatbelt. Y'all think he'd be mad if I stick a, a phone holder <laughs> on the dash of his Porsche? 
Y'all look fuzzy. Okay, I think that's a little better. Yeah, I want to put a phone holder right here on the dash so I can just cruise and talk to y'all. I ain't going to be able to talk to y'all long because as soon as he turn on this copyright music, I'm going to have to shut it down. So, yeah, I think this is my first football game. I know I've been to a college football game, but I'm pretty sure I haven't been to a pro football game. Nice. Is this your car, sir? Hmm. <laughs> You're not trying to take me in somebody else's vehicle, are you? Mm-mm. But yeah, so I believe I've been to a college football game, but this will be my first pro game with my boo. Hopefully, it's an enjoyable experience. You with me? You ain't got to worry. That's copyright on the shape right there. Oh, this, <laughs> this is a, a video song. Yeah. Song from one of your videos. Yeah. We get the vibe right. Really? <laughs> nice. They probably got my package on there. <laughs> Go to Amazon truck, y'all. Hopefully, we got my um, my vision board on his little truck. All right, I'll get y'all later. We here, y'all. Got to check out this game. Now, who playing? Seattle. Seattle. Russell Wilson. That's who you know. Sierra's husband. Really? <laughs> I know his name. Look.
Feel like falling deeper. Cold nights, I'm too much. 기다리기에는 너무 길어. 쳤던 내 사랑의 시간. 기대만 하는 것도 난 힘들어. No, I can't, just can't. 가져 내 마음을, 마저 내 가슴을. Hustle is real. <laughs> what was that? Fifty dollars for two hot dogs and two bag of chips. It's about the experience. Feel like falling deeper. Cold nights, not no more shit. Hi, you guys. Good afternoon. I say afternoon because it is 1245. <laughs> 1245 on Wednesday. Okay. I am currently waiting on a Chipotle delivery because your girl is hungry. And it's a Chipotle kind of day. Uh, it's bill pay day. And bill pay day is can be a lot for me. Okay. Because it's a lot. It's a lot over here. So anyways, it takes a lot out of me. And I feel like I deserve Chipotle today. So I'm having a little Chipotle. Okay. And <laughs> now that I am done paying bills. Um, I'm starting to think my vlogs are like all unboxing and... Um, haul vlogs because child, I got some more stuff delivered yesterday while I was at the game. The game was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. I really wasn't feeling it at first. I was like, eh, I don't want to go. Don't you want to go one at home, boys? You know, child, I didn't want to go, but I had a good time. You know, they be wilding out there like wild okay so yeah it was wild i did not know though when you go to these larger events now which they had you know at the gate they were doing um vaccination checks and stuff so you had to have your id your vaccination card all of that okay child so um i'm glad i had all of my stuff which i carry it all with me now anyway because like you just don't know so yeah, but I didn't know that there was like this clear bag policy thing, you know, to where when you go to like these events and sports events and stadiums and games and concerts and stuff that they can have like a clear bag policy where your purse has to be clear, you know, clear plastic. I'm like, what is a clear bag policy? Because child, my bag is not clear. So anyways, yeah, I had to like go to a locker, you know, I had to take out whatever I wanted to take out of my purse, you know, my ID and money and all that stuff and put it in my pockets. And I had to check my purse into a locker because I couldn't take my purse in there. Okay. And y'all saw my purse wasn't even that big. So this morning I was on Amazon scrolling, looking for clear purses and clear bags. 
just so I can have one available for if I ever go to, you know, any more games or events at stadiums and stuff, child, because I didn't know. So, yeah, I ordered me a little clear purse, and so I'll show you guys what it looks like. They have a few different options. I mean, you know, it's a clear purse, but they have little backpacks, little, you know, all kind of little stuff. So, I ordered one of those, but anyways, I'm sitting here waiting for my lunch, and then maybe after I eat my lunch, I will open my latest um, packages with you guys. I don't even, let me go look and see right quick what I have because I don't recall and I will go ahead and look and see what I got because I'm curious too child so yeah just looking at the packages I have here it looks like I have a couple things from Ulta I got something from Beauty Bakery I definitely been waiting on that and then this other package I don't know what that is child so anyway after I eat my lunch we'll open some packages okay yes thank you lord my lunch has arrived. Don't be hating on my lunch, y'all. Y'all know it looks delicious. Ooh, I love me some Chipotle. Silly of me, devoted so much time. Find you unfaithful, boy. I nearly lost my mind. Drive past your house every night in an unmarked car. What is this? Etat Libre, Libre de Orange. I think I remember what this is. I was scrolling through Instagram one night and I saw somebody had posted like a little reel or a little video or something. And it was regarding some fragrances, okay? And the description for these fragrances just... I was like, oh my goodness, I'm dying to know. And so they had like a sample pack of like almost all of their scents that they carry. <laughs> so your girl ordered the little sample pack, okay? So it's in this little box here. And I guess that's the name of the brand. It's Hot Libre de Orange Paris. So anyways, that's what it looks like. Let me know if you guys have heard of them. Am I just, have I been under a rock or something? Because i just seen, you know, seen this on Instagram. So this is what the actual fragrance bottles look like when you order them. So this is cool. Nice little description book or what have you for each fragrance. Okay, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. Okay, so anyway, that's what this is. What is this? Use this unique code for 15% off your full-size fragrance purchase. Okay, so they got me, sent me a little card here so I can get 15% off. I would share with y'all, but honey, I need my little 15% off, okay? So this is cool. This is what it looks, look at all these samples, y'all. Look at all of these samples in this box. I'm so excited. Should I just smell one for you guys? Spice Must Flow. Is that the name? Spice Must Flow. Look at that. That's what it says on there. I don't know if you guys can see that. But it says Spice Must Flow. And let me take a ganda. Yeah, it's just the regular cute little sample size boxes or you know sample size bottles i should say so that's what it looks like regular sample size okay so i am going to does this have a top on it no it does not don't break stuff kk okay so i'm gonna go ahead and spray this i'm gonna spray it on me too we're gonna take a chance okay hopefully it don't stink if it does i'll just be in there washing it off that's nice that is nice it's different it smells like one that I need to let sit on my skin for a minute too because my initial you know scent or my initial impression is that I do smell a bit of alcohol um, which usually means that it's gonna kind of die down quickly so 
I'll leave that on for a hot little minute and we'll see how it smells after uh, I finish the unboxing. But isn't that cute? If I can remember to um, look up the email, I will... Oh, that smells nice, actually. <laughs> I will um, list the price on the screen for you guys, how much I paid for these samples. And there are 20 samples in here. So, yeah. Anywho, one of my late night Instagram purchases. Okay, so I got that. Uh, let's see what this is. This is from Ulta. I'm wondering, this feels like a fragrance bottle. And I'm like, y'all sent my fragrance in this dang old envelope? Ought to be tripping sometime. But let's open her up. Let's see what she is. Just in case I'm talking mess. Oh, my bad. Sorry, Ulta. It's not a fragrance. It's a foundation. <laughs> okay, foundation. Zoeva. Authentic Skin natural luminous foundation so this is what the um, little box looks like here and what do i have 340w magical mm. let me see if i can show you guys what it looks like at least through the bottle i'm pretty sure this was on sale at ulta so i went ahead and grabbed it so i could try it oh okay so that's what it looks like very very pretty very very pretty so yeah we're gonna try this out and see what happens y'all okay see if it works for your girl my bad Ulta my bad okay so this better be my fragrance okay this is a Ulta box Okay, so let's see here. Prada Candy Night. Okay, so this is what she is. This is what I've been waiting for. My girl DJ showed this in her video. Just Peachy D, just in case you're not sure who I'm talking about when I say my girl DJ. She's one of my besties, and she does have a YouTube channel. She has a boutique, Instagram, all of that. Just Peachy D. So... Anyway, she was just going on and on about this Prada candy night. Okay, so let's check it out. I like the bottle, though, just, just by itself. The bottle is beautiful. Is it broke? Is it supposed to be like that? Yeah. Oh, that's the little thing that keeps it from squirting. You see why I thought it was broken? I was like, what in the world? So, I'm assuming that's the little, you know, cap to keep it from squirting. So, this is what the bottle looks like. Like I said, the packaging alone had me wanting this fragrance, okay? So, mm, that other scent, it smells really nice now. It smells spicy and floral. Warm, kind of like... I don't know if it has like a gourmand. I don't know if I really know what gourmand is at this point in time, but it definitely has like a warm, musky, yet floral smell to it. Oh, that smells good. It's, yeah, it smells real nice now that I let it sit. Okay, so Prada Candy. Do I just, is this one? Yeah, this looks like one of the ones that just squirts. So I don't want to keep pulling the sprayer off. So um, let me spray over here. Okay, so I'm going to spray this one on this wrist. I know, I know. But I want to spray it on my... Ooh, that smells sweet. I don't know what the, uh, the notes are. I'll put them on the screen if I remember. Ooh, that smells good. I like it. I'm going to let that sit for a while too. I'm going to let it sit for a while because I still kind of have this spicy floral scent in my nose. Ooh. Does it have vanilla in it? Is it vanilla in there? That smells... Mmm, that smells good. Okay, okay. You was right, DJ. You was right, girl. It don't stink. 
Okay, so I got that. And then, what is this? Okay, this is what I've really been waiting for from Beauty Bakery, okay? I have been sitting outside, looking through the blinds, peeking through the window, waiting for this box to arrive, okay? And it took forever. So let me go ahead and open this up. You know, Beauty Bakery has like the cute packaging, you know, real cute packaging. So let's see what's up in here. Mini moments. Okay. So they got this little card that has their, some of their pro products on there. If you're not familiar with Beauty Bakery, it's like their theme is, you know, like a bakery shop. So it's real cute how they do their makeup products and stuff. So this here is the Sweet Grace Baking Spray, of course. So it's setting spray, but they're calling it a baking spray. Super cute. Uh, let's see here. What else did I buy? Child, it's been so long, I don't even remember what I bought. But they had a really, really good sale. A really good sale, okay? This is the Butter... Hydra Silk Primer. This came out quite a while ago and I never tried it. So I decided to go ahead and grab it and try it while it was on sale. So it is a primer. I'm not going to open that up. It just looks like a stick. Stick of butter. Um, And then this, what else did I try? Matte Liquid Lipstick. Oh yeah. This is the um, what shade is this? cranberry yeah i saw this and i was like this is what the box looks like but i saw it and i was like oh my gosh that red looks so beautiful let me see oh yeah okay hold on let me see if i can get this out of here so this is the color this is what it looks like isn't it pretty that is gorgeous i can i can see Ooh, smells good too i can see that on my lips so very, very pretty, beautiful red matte liquid lipstick. Okay, so got that. Um, what else did I get? Ciao. Look like I was shopping. That's probably why I was waiting for it. These are the blending eggs. So these are beauty sponges. And they come in this cute little egg carton here. I'm not going to open it up, but I bought one. Of, no, I got one of these in my boxy charm, I think, before super duper cute i think there's like some pink ones and some blue ones in here but they're just beauty sponges that are like in a cute little egg carton container so cute and then i think i got one more thing this is what i was like the most excited to see because it's new from them and i was like ooh, 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 i want those this is the beauty bakery anything for the cookies it's a cookie jar with four pair of reusable vegan eyelashes. So this is what the box looks like. So let me open this up and show you guys what it looks like. If you guys haven't seen it, you're going to just die. You're going to be like, oh my gosh, it's so cute. If you have seen it, then you already know what it looks like. But child, I thought this was the cutest thing. And I love cookies. Hello. Hello. Look at this. Look at this. Get out of town. <laughs> Do you see this? I know it's a lot of glare going on and stuff, but get out of town. Do you see the cute little, look at, child. Look at that. Those are little eyelash, eyelash holders. I don't even want to open it up. It's so stinking cute. But let me go ahead and open it up. See if I can save my little sticker. Okay, so open it up. You got your little cookies in there. Do you see how cute this is? Y'all. If you don't think this is cute, I don't know what to tell you. So this is one of the little eyelash holders, the chocolate chip cookie one. So that's what it looks like on the back. I don't know if you can see that. I'm not in my beauty space with all my lights, and y'all know I can't see no way, so cute so the little holder it has the mirror in there and then it has the lashes get out of town get out of town 
this is cute <laughs> okay i i love cute packaging but they they did it with this one so this one is kind of like a cute little what does it say morio cookie so it's like a s'more and an oreo cookie so cute i may as well show you guys i don't even you can't even really see because it's so dark but that's what those look like what is this this one is sugar cookie cute little sugar cookie package i haven't been this excited to get no beauty products in a minute so that's what the sugar cookie looks like girl and this last one is peanut butter so that's the peanut butter cookie let me show you what these look like yeah so that's what the peanut butter cookie lashes look like okay ciao i am so excited i'm so excited i love it i cannot wait to put this you know somewhere in my little beauty space honey because it is too cute so yeah i'm excited to try these different items from beauty bakery the setting mist um the butter primer i'm curious about that because that mug is expensive i definitely wasn't buying that unless it was on sale and so i got a new lipstick and whatnot but yeah so excited got some cute stuff but yeah that's it y'all